by uh, Professor Mitsuhiro Miyazaki from Kyoto University of Education. Uh, this talk will, uh, will present his research on Herald rings and Hibi rings. So over to you, uh, Mitsuhiro. Thank you. So thank you for a second time for um, of my talk. Um, last week, I noticed that the Earhart ring, uh, the canonical module of the Earhart ring can be written is uh, can be written by this way, um, by the description of the canonical module of Stanley. And first, uh, uh, since this is this is an idea of uh, the Earhart ring, EKP, I call this idea the canonical idea. And first, uh, since uh, the canonical idea is uh, reflexive, canonical module is reflexive, uh, this idea is a divisorial idea. So first, uh, I present uh, the symbolic powers of uh, these canonical ideals of Hebe rings and the Earhart rings of chain tops. For that purpose, first I define the group of divisors. Let R be a material. Uh, normal domain. And I, the uh, fraction idea. That is a uh, finitely generated module, sub, a uh, uh, sub module of the quotient field and I is divisorial if and only if double column of I is I itself. This QR is the quotient field, uh, quotient field of R. And we denote by D bar the set of divisorial ideals. Oh, wow. Then um, div R is a group. by the operation i times j is defined by a double column of ij in the usual product. Then, uh, the bar is a uh, free abelian group with basis i to one prime ideals.
Um, we did not uh, the end power. of I in D bar uh, by I to the parenthesis N. And if I is a proper ideal, then I to the parenthesis N and, uh, and M is positive, then I to the parenthesis M is the symbolic power. Now we we call the uh, a hat ring. Uh, let X be a finite set. And P uh, rational. Convex top in R to the X and, and he can be the the air how to win. and then I said uh, several time ago, uh, several minutes ago, that uh, this is The canonical module of EKP can be uh, is described by Stanley that F runs through uh, uh, the integer valid functions such that f minus infinity is positive and one by f minus infinity times f is relative integer of p. Then our uh, focus is that Hibbelin uh, that is uh, the order, uh, a hat ring of order to the top and uh, the a hat ring of chain to the top. Ah, before that, uh, we uh, recall that, recall that uh, this ideal, this canonical ideal is contained in uh, um, div, div EKP, that is, this canonical ideal is divisorial because the uh, canonical module is reflexive. And now we focus on our attention that uh, the air heart ring of order and chain photons 
first consider the order portop. We call the definition of order portop is here. Uh, F is the function from P to R such that um, all the values of uh, between zero and one and x is less than y in p implies fx is greater than or equals to fy in r. But uh, since uh, uh, I consider uh, uh, if I don't mention um, a poset is always a uh, finite poset. Since we are considering finite poset, this can be written as follows. That is, we only have to consider the uh, x is covered by uh, the case where x is covered by y. Then, then uh, what is the relative interior of OP? Since, in fact, OP is a full dimensional non degenerate convex polytop. Uh, relative interior and interior coincide, but uh, I write relative interior because coherence to uh, general Erhard ring. Uh, When considering relative interior, uh, the, these equal inequality must be strict inequality. So, Relative interior of OP equals can be written this way. So suppose if is integer values and f minus empty is positive, then one by this condition, one by f minus empty times f is relative interior of OP uh, first I should note that one by uh, F minus infinity times F is contained in OP if and only if For any x in P, uh, fx is less than or e less, uh, greater than equals to zero and less than equals to f minus empty and 
x is covered by y implies fx is greater than or equals to fy. This is the condition of 1 by f if t is con times f is contained in OP and relative interior for relative interior uh, this is replaced by f1 times uh, fx is less greater than zero and less than f minus empty and if x is covered by y then fx is strictly less than or uh, greater than fy and since since the value of f are uh, integers uh, we see that this is equivalent to fx is greater than uh, or equals to 1 for any x. And x is covered by y in p minus, then fx is greater than or equals to fy plus 1. Uh, I can uh, include this condition by this uh, by applying x equals to minus empty. So this inequality can be absorbed in this way. And remember, uh, Remember, uh, these two conditions. Now, consider the chain portal. Um, chain portal is defined by as follows fx is real valid functions of x such that fx is greater than or equals to for any x and the sum of chains is less than or equals to one for any chain C. But since the values are always non negative, we only have to consider the maximal chains, ma maximal chains that, that is you know, maximal. Uh, by in terms of in, inclusion relation. Now, then What if the condition of integer valid function f that one by f infinity times f is contained in chain or top or relative interior of it is Um, F is 
the value of f is greater than or equals to zero for any x and the sum of the values of the chain elements of values of elements of chain C is less than or equals to F minus empty for any for any chain C for any maximal chain. And run by F empty times F is contained in relative interior of chain point of P if and only if this becomes strict, strict inequality. And And since the value of f are integers, f is an integer valued function. So this can be rewritten as follows. If x is greater than or equals to one for any x and f plus c is less than or equals to f empty minus one for any maximal chain C. Now, keeping in mind these two, uh, this can be written as plus zero. And for chain pull top, this is also can be written plus zero. This is plus one, this is plus zero. This is minus one, but uh, so I should write, write this as false. This is plus one and this is plus zero. So keep this in mind. Uh, I make the following definition. For M, for integer M, T and P be the set of integer valued function from P minus such that if X, the value of X is greater than or equals to M for any P and X is covered in, covered by Y in P minus then if x is greater than or equals to f y plus m, and s n p be the set of integer valid functions. such that 
uh, fx is greater than or equals to 4mem and f plus c plus m is less than or equals to f minus infinity for any maximal chain. C. Then by the fact uh, noticed about we see that T to the F is contained in the canonical module of order pole top. If and only F is contained in T zero P. Yes, T zero P. Yeah. <laughs> yes, and I have noticed that as I have noticed uh, earlier that T to the F is contained in the, uh, the canonical module of canonical ideal of the order the of the a hat ring of the order per top if and only if f is contained in t one p the same similar facts is similar facts holds for chain tops uh, T to the F is contained in EKCP if and only if F is contained in S0P and T to the F is contained in omega of the canonical ID of the chain, uh, the air hat ring of the chain portal. If and only if F is contained in S to the parenthesis one of Uh, if is contained in S to the one, in parenthesis one. And in fact, this is my theorem. Uh, suppose M is, suppose M is an integer. Then, mm, and positive. Then, mm, omega to the n of e k o p order for top is identical to the ordinary power of. EKOP and this is uh, K vector space with uh, T to the F where F runs through T script T and P and omega minus N same thing happens for omega minus omega to the minus n, that is uh, omega to the parenthesis minus n is identical to the ordinary power of omega to the omega inverse of n times n its power of omega inverse. And this is 
the vectors is with basis T to the F, where F runs through script T minus T to the minus M. And same thing, same thing holds for chain photo. But this time, of course, we replace T by S. So next consider the generators of canonical modules, canonical ideas of uh, chain and order functions. First, let suppose that M is in T1. T1P or S1P. Then T to the mu is a generator of omega EKOP. or EK omega. EK CP, if and only if there are no new one in T1 or is one and no new two in T zero or is zero such that new two is not equals to zero and new equals to new one plus new two. This is very elementary fact. And I have described um, that the mm, generators uh, are condition mm, of this by the notion of uh, sequence, n sequence or n prime sequence I named. Uh, then sequence and prime sequence. I give a definition here. Let T be a non-negative integer. And Y0, X1, Y1, Yt minus 1, xt are uh, elements of p. p is uh, uh, the fixed process, finite process. Then this y0, x1, y1, x2, yt minus 1, xt is 
and M sequence or M prime sequence if and only if this is definition first condition is y0 is greater than yx1 y1 this means up down down up down up y t minus one x t and two uh, if um, j is greater than or equals to x r i plus two then um, y j no y i is not greater than or equals to x j or y i is not greater than strictly greater than x j for condition for n sequence this condition is up for n prime sequence this condition is up so n prime sequence is uh, weaker n prime sequence is weaker than n sequence that is all the n sequences are uh, n prime sequences let me explain by examples let p be uh, before that uh, we usually add x0 equals to minus empty and yt equals to plus empty and consider x0, y0, x1, y1. yt minus 1, xt, yt. So this is the reason of this numbering of subscription. Let me explain uh, the notion of n sequence and n prime sequence by this by examples first the, consider this and this poset this is y rounded this element is x1 then this is an n sequence This is an N sequence. And if we add minus empty equals to X zero and uh, plus empty equals to Y one, then no, mm. sorry, 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 this is y0, then x0, y0, x1, y1, this looks like something like the capital N 
so I named uh, n sequence, or there are sequence which satisfy the conditions of these uh, con condition. These condition uh, I named condition n because this looks like something look, looks like condition uh, capital letter M. Um, consider another example. And that y0 x1, y1, and this again, x2, uh, then y2, then this is uh, n prime n prime sequence. But not M sequence. Okay, it's okay. So so I to um, state the main theorem concerning this uh, generators of canonical ideals, I use this notation. For W0, Z0, W1, Z1 up to C1 up to W S Z S in P plus minus we set with with uh, up down up down We set Q1, W0, Z0, up to WS, ZS is the sum of uh, ranks. Um, w, U. The closed interval of rank, where closed interval x y is um, um, z in p plus minus z is greater than or equals to x and less than or equals to y and sum of u equals to 1 to s rank of w of u minus n of u minus u w of u w of u W of W U W U Z of U minus one. Let me explain this by example. Mm. 
by the previous example, let uh, this is y0, x1, and um, plus empty here and minus empty here. Then q1 minus empty y0, x1 plus empty equals to first consider the rank between this interval. Then rank is three. No, rank considers the covering relation. So three and next consider this interval and rank of this interval. And this is rank one. And next consider the rank of this interval. This is rank three. and consider the other one. Y1, uh, no. Y0, X1, Y1, and X2. And plus empty, minus empty. And Q1 is Q1 Y0 X1, Q1 minus empty Y0 X1 Y1 uh, X2 and plus empty equals to uh, first constant here. So rank is three. And next consider this interval. Rank is one, minus one, so minus one. And next consider this interval. Rank is three. And next consider this interval. Rank is one, so minus one. And next consider this interval. Rank is three, so seven. Um, why I define this notion by, why I uh, denote this no notion by Q1, uh, this is uh, Q, uh, there's also Q mi minus one in my paper. So um, if you have interest, uh, please consult my paper. Now, I have to define another notion here. Let let y zero x one up to y t minus one x t is an n n seconds or n prime seconds if for any i j with i is less than or equals to j minus 2 and uh, xi is less than y j it holds rank of xi yj is strictly less than Q1 of Xi Yi up to Xj 
my j then we say that uh, this n sequence or n prime sequence is q1 reduced where uh, I should have Um, I may be zero and J may be T. What is X zero? Well, I define X zero is minus empty and Y T is plus empty. For example, um, if this kind of shortcut if there is there this kind of shortcut this shortcut may be allowed, but this kind of shortcut or this kind of shortcut not allowed in the in the part of sequence now uh, i can describe i can describe Generators by uh, this notion. Uh, let D be an integer. Then there is a generator. Of canonical ID of order product that is hibiting or canonical module of the air hat ring of chain product if and only if uh, ah, with degree D if and only if uh, there is a uh, there is a Q1 reduced 
m seconds m prime seconds y0 x1 up to y t minus 1 x t with q minus uh, q1 uh, minus mt y0 um, up to uh, xt plus mt equals to d. This is the uh, criterion of possible degrees of generators of uh, the canonical ideal. As a corollary, we, uh, because I uh, because I considered uh, studied uh, the inverse of the canonical module simultaneously, so um, I stated this proposition by D may be a um, uh, negative integer. Uh, of course, uh, for canonical module, uh, it is only uh, D, is, D can be only positive integers. By considering this pro proposition, uh, we call the definition of n seconds t may be zero t if t is zero this is empty set so this is uh, rank of uh, rank of the um, p plus minus so ek mm, op is level that is uh, the generators of the canonical id are constant only one degree the degrees of generators Generator may, may there are may, there may be many generators, but the degrees are constant. That is level. That is called level. If and only if. Oh, I should write. If and only if uh, Q one reduced M seconds is in prime seconds is the empty. Seconds only. Since uh, n seconds is always n prime seconds, we see the following corollary. If if the a hat ring of the chain port top is level. Then so is the A hat ring of the other port top, the heavy ring. So time is up. I stop here. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, we will take questions now. You can open your microphone and uh, ask questions.
I have a question regarding the uh, uh, description of the canonical ideal. Yes. So uh, your description uh, gives a commentorial uh, description of the canonical ideal. Yes. Uh, yeah. So uh, I suppose uh, so. I read one paper long time ago from uh, Stanley. Uh, and uh, so that that looks at linear Diophantine equations, uh, ah, linear. linear Diophantine equations, and looks for uh, non-negative integer solutions. Yes. And then we associate a uh, semi-group ring uh, yeah. generated by monomials, where the exponent vectors of the monomials are corresponding to the solutions, non-negative solutions. Yes. So does this description that you have described, given of canonical ideal, uh, how will it translate into properties of the solutions? Um, which solutions, I mean, which monomials uh, will yeah. give you the canonical ideal in that setting? Does it give a proof of, uh, this is the old theorem of Stanley that the, uh, uh, the, in the interior nearest to the origin, look at these solutions which are nearest to the origin. Uh, uh, nearest to the origin. Um, in fact, uh, any solution, uh, you mean that... Uh, I'm just trying to understand the, how does the combinatorial interpretation of the canonical ideal uh give uh, how does it translate uh, for the solutions of linear diophantine equations which solutions will give you the canonical ideal of the uh, semi group ring um you mean that these equations uh, uh, mm, uh, the, uh, Sorry, I I understand. And this time, um, chain polytope and uh, order polytope are non-degenerate. That is, the dimension of uh, this polytope has uh, maximal dimension. That is, uh, the number of elements in P. So, um, that kind of description is uh, a canonical module or uh, 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 a hat, um, uh, convex head of cone which is degenerate, that is, uh, contains some. Uh, lower dimensional uh, subspace and positive uh, entries. Mm -hmm. So um, this time uh, it does not, it is a um, uh, non-degenerate case. So probably that uh, there's no um, correspondence to that kind of uh, questions, that kind of problem, I think. Okay, okay. Yeah. But Stanley's, Stanley's uh, result says that if, uh, if there is a unique, strictly positive solution, smallest, a unique a strictly positive solution, then the semi-group ring is Gorenstein. Uh, so, uh, this, and that, this that, that, is that case of, uh, this is not the case. Um, uh, this, this, uh, this example, uh, okay, I write. Both um, order and chain polytope, 
but uh, uh, this example, for this example, both order and chain protocols, uh, two uh, generators. That is, that is uh, um, one, two, three, one, two, three, four. This is one. And this is one generator, and this one, one, two, three, and two, three, four, and five. This is uh, another generator. And this uh, two generators of uh, Hibbing. But uh, this generator is DB4 and this generator is DB5. The value of minus empty is the D. So this um, um, in, in this case, the canonical module, uh, uh, canonical, canonical. Canonical module have only one generator with minimal DB. But this is not Gorenstein because another generator is needed. So this time, um, that that is not true. Okay, okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, do we have uh, any other question? Yeah, so I don't see any questions right now. Okay, so thank you very much, Professor Miyazaki, for your uh, two talks. We are thank you. really uh, very interesting results about canonical ideals of Erhard rings and Hebe rings. Uh, thank you very much. Thank you very much.